I found a little trash. I forgot the bags today, but I can still pick up a little. Ooh, I'm going in. All right. Good morning, world. How's it going? Nothing like starting your day with a little bit of swimming. Right there. Today, I gotta do some prep work on this truck right here. This is the new vlog rocket. We're gonna be rebuilding this truck. Gonna be taking it to shows, all kinds of cool stuff. So far, we got a couple of sponsors, one being MKW Wheels, and the other one recently we just got is Toyo Tires. But today, all I gotta do is take off some of the vinyl. I've already taken uh, some of the carbon vinyl that 3M initially put on there when it used to be a SEMA truck. I'm gonna take the vinyl off the hood here today, and we're gonna prep the truck for some new stuff. Somebody got a bath. The vinyl on this truck has been on there for about six years now, so it's pretty baked on. For the past hour, uh, I haven't really made that much progress, but I don't have a heat gun or anything like that. We're gonna be taking it down to Ken's shop, and we're gonna be doing a lot of it there. Now, the concept for this truck, the Vlog Rocket, potentially looks like this. This is the poster, and it's gonna be a wicked cool truck, but I have some ideas that will expand above and beyond just a black truck. And Ken and I have to experiment with that a little bit. We're gonna have a little bit more vinyl, but not to cover the whole truck. The sides, they're gonna be something special. RF is going back today and a new Volvo, the Swedish car, is coming in. We're doing a swap. I'm not sure exactly the Volvo that's going to be coming in. It's not necessarily a car that you take to car shows, but we are going to be doing uh, quite a bit of driving with it. But this coming weekend, we have a couple of other shows that we're going to be attending, and I'm going to be joining my buddy Michael Axon, who's got a collection of cars. We're going to be grabbing a couple of his cars and going to those shows. Saturday is Ferrari of Westlake. If you want something to do this weekend, join us. Not much time left before the Volvo shows up. It's going to be any time now, but Kathy needs to do some errands. Going. Yeah, it'll show Volvo. <laughs> I smell something. You smell that? It smells like something Swedish. Right there. <laughs> this is the Volvo V90 Cross Country T6. I, I don't know what all those numbers mean or what the, but I, I don't know anything about it. They just brought it in. It looks pretty freaking awesome. Check that out. That's a sweet looking ride right there. fancy schmancy cars today. Uh, some interesting stuff. I do have a few announcements uh, to wrap up the vlog. Something sweet has showed up. Was, I don't know what to say. It's pretty freaking cool. 
Big thanks to Volvo for sending me the V90 Cross Country T6 all-wheel drive. I don't know what T6 stands for, but it sounds kind of cool. I mean, you know, it's all-wheel drive. All-wheel drive. Did I mention it's all-wheel drive? It's a freaking station wagon is what it is. And, and I, you know, I grew up in station wagons. I, I love station wagons. I, you know, you just put all that stuff in there and you just go have a good time. Let's talk horsepower for a second. 316 horsepower, 295 foot-pounds. I don't know what the car weighs, but I'm, I'm assuming it's going to have some get up and go. We're going to be driving this for the next seven days. We're going to be going and doing stuff. This is the vlog. This is what we do on the vlog and, and it's pretty freaking awesome. But I bet you're dying to know. I bet you're dying to know exactly how much that car is. Can you guess it? Can you get what, you know, what do you think it looks, you know, it's, it's a pretty freaking nice station wagon. Although they're not gonna call it a station wagon. There's probably a Swedish term for that, I don't know. I do know it's got 25 miles per gallon on average. Not too bad for, you know, a station wagon. Swedish, Swedish station wagon. You know what would make this car perfect? You know, <laughs> you know what would make it perfect? If the entire back, back end, you know, was filled with Swedish fish. That would make it perfect. Do I hear 50,000? 55,000, 60,000, how about 64,000 for a station wagon? You know, I don't think that I would have bought a station wagon when I was a kid at 64,000. In fact, I think it was probably 6,400 for a station wagon, maybe less. Sign of the times, people, sign of the times. What are you gonna do about it? I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna drive the shit out of it. That's what I'm gonna do. Second thing, second thing on the books, uh, you guys know that I have a bunch of kids' books. I have the big book of Wacky States. I got the custom car coloring book. Well, it's going to be spawning some siblings. I got some more coloring books that are going to be coming. I don't know. I just love creating coloring books. I love kids. It's really a fun thing to do. You know, it's a great gift to be able to give a kid something that they get to draw with. You know, that's what I loved as a kid. Who doesn't love coloring books? Anyway, right now you can go online to Amazon and you can grab one of my coloring books, uh, the custom car coloring book, or the big book of Wacky States. You know, it, that's not a coloring but, but it is informative. It does help kids learn about the states. But anyway, I'm going to be creating more of those books. I'm very excited, super stoked. And my my uh, my table is full of sketches and things, things like this that I'm going to be pulling ideas from. I just went in my closet and found all these little doodles, and I, I'm I'm digging some of these things. There's all kinds of freaking cool cars. I mean. Look at this stuff. I got loads of it. I'm going to be assembling and creating my next coloring book. Uh, the schedule is to get it done by the beginning of next month in September. And then I'm going to launch another coloring book right before Christmas, which is going to be super cool. And then the last thing, the last thing, the last thing I want to mention, and that is that Kathy's sister, Susie, she lives in New Jersey. Uh, she is the village health coach on Instagram. Check her out. She's doing some really cool stuff. She's got some great drinks that she's working on. She and Kathy are kind of working in tandem. Uh, Susie is working the, the East Coast. Kathy's working the West Coast. We got another great recipe coming up on Saturday from the Malibu Vegan Kitchen. All kinds of cool stuff happening on the blog all the time. Big thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe. I love you guys so much. Adios, muchachos and muchachas. Both. <laughs>